Matt, congratulations. Back into conference play with a win at Lewis and Clark on Friday night. Give us a recap of how you saw the Pirates play. Well, uh, you know, great opportunity for us to kind of get you know, get back in a rhythm and continue to, to build some momentum coming off the, the long holiday break. I thought it was uh, it's good to, to be on the road and ha have that time together to just kind of lock in and, and focus. Um, you know, we got off to a pretty good start against Lewis and Clark, uh, built in an advantage. They made a nice run in the first half, and I thought we responded well to that in building a 15-point cushion at, at halftime. Um, you know, did some did some really nice things. We're sloppy at times, um, so it was a great uh, great game in terms of the, the teachable moments, the things we could learn from uh, that will directly apply to this week moving forward. As a coach, how do you structure a week like this where you've got three games in five days, uh, in, in including a midweek game? Uh, what is it that you're doing to account for that all that action? Well, you pretty much take it one day at a time. You know, uh, tomorrow's game against Whitman is, is kind of the, the back end of last weekend in conference play and, and how I look at it. And then uh, once we get through Tuesday, uh, you know, we'll, we'll regroup and then uh, start to prepare for, for Friday and Saturday. Um, but, you know, each game is its own 40-minute window, and, and uh, you've got to play them one at a time. And so uh, you just take it one day at a time and, and prepare um, as we have all year long. Talk about uh, the Blues and, and what we face on Tuesday night. Well, you know, I, I'm not sure uh, there's a, a better uh, rivalry uh, in the country, you know, in, in the last few years um, than Whitman and Whitworth. And uh, the games that we've played uh, for the last three, four years have, have been some of the, the most epic uh, basketball games that, that have, have been played in the field house and uh, in Walla Walla. So, um, we know what to expect in terms of the intensity of the game. Uh, both teams are very experienced. Uh, both teams have been there before, and so uh, it should be a great, great experience for our for our guys. Uh, obviously, uh, it's a it's a big game in terms of uh, the historic, um, you know, conference champion. Uh, you know, has kind of gone through either Spokane or Walla Walla the last couple of years, and and so we know uh, how. You know how how much is riding on this game, uh, but at the same token, you know it's still very early in conference play. Uh, teams are trying to to to, to kind of finalize uh, their rotations and who they can trust in, in certain moments. And so, uh, regardless of uh, of what happens on Tuesday, there's a whole lot of basketball in front of us. And so, uh, we've got to you know maintain perspective, uh, you know, as we get through uh, this entire week and and take it one day at a time.